Welcome to episode two of XVU Infinite. I'm your host, Nathaniel Hansen. For this episode of XVU Infinite, we're going all in on Finite. A few years ago, we made an episode of Finite the first, in the first season that was all about Thanksgiving. And, well, we decided to end the second season of Finite on that note as well. So, without any further ado, a Finite Thanksgiving, number two in 2021. Enjoy. Is that another uh, salesman? Nope. Wonder where James is. He missed last Thanksgiving. Did I tell you about that? Yeah. Huh. Good for me. Good for me. What else did I tell you? You told me to sell a house. You wanted me to sell a way. Oh. You wanted. Did you sell the house yet? I'm working on a few things to sell the house. We're doing a great discount, million dollars off, so you can only get it for now a million if you act right now. That's a lot of money for that house. But that's also a lot off. That's like 50% off. It is. You're pretty good at that, aren't you? I, I have the best deals in town. Cheers to that. Hi, I'm Logan. Hi. Are you another character for this thing? Uh... Yeah. What was that supposed to mean? I don't want to talk about it. Okay. I'm sorry. It's fine. Is this cranberry juice? Oh. Yes. I don't, I don't know much around here anymore. I don't really know what's going on either, so... Good to meet you.
Oh, I think that's the last guess. Hey, I got the cranberry sauce. I'm so excited for some cranberry sauce. I even brought my own cranberry sauce for this cranberry sauce party. I love cranberry cookies, cranberry hamburgers, cranberry pizza, you name it. I love it. If there's cranberry on it, I'm there. Hey, everybody. How's it going? It's good to see you, Logan. Good to see you. Yeah, it's good to see you, too, Blake. <laughs> How's everybody doing? You... Is everything all right? Did, yeah. did I miss something? No, I don't think so. Today's just a little surprising. Okay, yeah. I wonder why. Hey guys, it's Ryan from that thing that you're watching right now. You know, the thing. Yeah, what a wacky episode. That's crazy. Huh? <sighs> well, guess what? I got the thing for you. I've sold peeps. I've sold a lighter. I've sold a weight. I'm selling a house. Well, now I'm selling you this. It is a brand new t-shirt. You're like, I've seen t-shirts before. It's an XVU t-shirt. The makers of this very show. And guess what? With winter coming around the corner and Christmas, they would make a great gift. But it's also getting really cold. So not just a t-shirt. We also got sweat... Sweatshirts. XVU sweatshirts. So soft, so warm. It'll keep you warm all holiday season long. Get it now. And guess what? If you act also right now, you can also support them on Patreon. If you love these wacky episodes that you see, it helps them create even more. And it also gives me a nice warm feeling inside. And a house to live in. They, they pay my rent. No, we don't do that. Buy it anyways today, XVU system. The link is gonna be in the description. So is the Patreon. That one's on the house. Thank you. Well, all the other guests are here. So I guess um, we can dig in. All right. This is a toast to my friend Ryan. Thank you for showing up. You're welcome. And thank you for trying to sell the house. If you make me that million dollars, I will give you a dollar out of it. That's highway robbery I'm in. Thank you so much. You are a gracious host. So, you uh, have any of this? Actually, what is this? We think it's cranberry juice, but we're not sure. Cranberry we... juice? Uh, yeah. I've heard of such a great invention. Let me... Let me... Oh, yeah! That's good stuff. Hmm. I gotta taste it, though. You taste it? I, I did not. I did not. Come on, why don't you... Join me. Come on. This, this is a cranberry want, party. my glass let's as go. well? Possibly. Yeah, sure. Bring it on over here. Yeah, let's, I'll just go two and two. Let me try this, though. Okay. Yeah, don't... Got to swirl a little bit, you know? Isn't that what they do with cranberry sauce? Or uh, juice, excuse me? It's basically cranberry liquid. That, that's all it is. Liquid cranberry, yes. Mmm. <sighs> mmm. Mm. Wow. That's really... That, that's some good... You sure you're... Come on. Come on. Oh, uh, oh, uh, come on. Uh, come on. Uh, all right, fine. That. I understand. I understand. Let me try this one more time. Ooh. Man, I can't get enough of this. <clears throat> Oh, woo! Yeah, mm, that's good. Mm, very good. Yep, I sold cranberries to a cranberry farmer down in Wisconsin. Nice. Yeah, ten thousand dollars a pound. That's not a bad price. No. I wonder 
how things are going on in there. This one works so much better at swirling than the other. Does that make any sense? Hmm. Ow! Did you just kick me, Kaylee? No. The who was supposed to have kicked me? Oh, oh Kaylee. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Very strange. Very strange. Cranberry juice is good. Oh, very good. Is this diet? I think it, just no sugar added. Oh, wow. So similar, but not quite. Oh, that's good. It's good to be healthy. Compliments to the chef. Thanks. I uh, opened the can myself. Oh, that's... I wish I could cook. I just sell things. I mean, that's all your character needs, right? That's right. And, and, and you don't need to be anything more than the person who sells stuff. That's true. I am who I am. You are. And you're great. I hate cranberry sauce. I'm taking my cranberry sauce with me. Got anything to sell me? I'll say you have some advice. For, I'll give you a thought for about mm, a nickel off of a thousand dollars. How about I'll give you a new story in the next season of Finite. Hmm. You got yourself a deal. So what's the advice? Well, I forgot. How do you feel about that? I hope you enjoyed this episode of XView Infinite, and if you are in the U.S. or somewhere else that happens to be celebrating Thanksgiving, I hope you enjoy. Also, if you're watching this in the future, I hope you enjoyed looking back on this um, fun time we had. And, uh, yeah, see you on the next show, episode, whatever, well, whatever we do next. See you next month. Hi, Blake. <sighs> and you see, that's when my grandma stepped on my baby bird. <laughs> and it was the first time I experienced death. <laughs> that's a pretty great character arc. <laughs> and that is why I... I have devoted my life to selling peeps. For the baby bird. <laughs> you smell that? Smells like a great opportunity to sell something. I got just the thing for you, cause I smell fire. And you know what goes on fire? Water. I got the perfect water canister right here. Bottle, whatever James. you call it. You could James, what are you doing? No, stop. stop. You no. could. No, stop. You could um, drink it if you were thirsty. You could, with this water, you could, it's H2O, it is a chemistry compound. Um, 
freeze it. It becomes ice. It's multi versatile. It's yours for nineteen ninety five ninety five. Three easy payments. Uh, Venmo. So, I went outside and to see what James was really doing, and uh, he um he was burning the box home so that no one else could have it. And uh, I guess that was the end of season two. How does that make you feel? Well, I guess I kind of feel out of control. You know, I had this story with characters, but then the box home. Well, can't really do anything about it anymore, can I? You know, I think this role of, I don't know, this storyteller, I don't know, it's kind of stressful. Sometimes I kind of think that I need to, I don't know, maybe step away from the front. Maybe find someone else to replace me as, um, you know, the purple shirt guy. Finite, you know, that whole thing. You know, I think that might be a good idea. That might be a really good idea for the next season. So I was right down this mountain, but not because I wanted to. There were like two bears. What? Yes, and I had the... I, you know, I had something they wanted. I don't know, something in my backpack. So I just kept running. You're kidding me. I'm not kidding. That's and crazy. they didn't catch me. What? I was hiking with another fellow. Huh. And he ended up making it out. But he was just a little slower than I was. So, you know. You know. Dude, that's crazy, man. But I just kept running and running. And then eventually got to the parking lot. But I was still running. Hmm. So then he caught me with the car. Whoa. Yeah. That's cool, man. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Nice story. Some Thanks for sharing. Big bears. Dude, can't even imagine. Darn bears. It might have been a dream, though. I can't... Memory's a little foggy. No, nah, I think you got it. I think, I think so. It I think so too. I think it so sounded too. real to me. That's yeah. for sure. Where did everyone else go? That's a good question. Hmm. How long were we talking about bears for? Or running from Ooh. bears? Probably like two hours or so. That's a lot of talk. Totally worth it. <laughs>